folks, howdy, Sean Brock here with you again, and I would like to remind you, please subscribe if you wouldn't mind, we're trying to corner the market for the boutique world and you, the listener. So far, we haven't done either one, but we're still trying, and today we have a guitar from a couple of guys way up in New Hampshire, way down, way down south in New Hampshire there, just uh, south of Canada. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and this is from Siren Acoustic Guitars. Greg and Josh have been visiting with us and uh, sharing some of their creations and letting me play them and, uh, and uh, drool over them and record them so you might uh, hear them and drool over them and get in trouble with your spouse. And uh, this instrument is for sale. This is a mahogany and Adirondack instrument we'll talk all about the specs on it here in just a few minutes but uh, see the description box check out siren acoustic guitars on the web on facebook all that fine stuff and uh, take a look at what these guys are doing if you don't know them if you haven't met them if you haven't seen them floating around there uh, just check them out i think i think you'll be surprised at some of the custom work that they're doing uh, and 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 just as a uh, you know just as a side note, I usually don't discuss anything to do with finances on here. But uh, they're they're not one of these builders that that the average uh, guitar buyer can't afford. So check out Siren Acoustic Guitars, and let's take a listen to this great mahogany. <laughs> played four siren guitars. I've played a, a double O, a triple O, uh, Paduke Dreadnought, and this uh, Mahogany. And uh, uh, the uh, small bodies were, were uh, uh, Alpine spruce tops. And uh, from over there in the old country, you know, over Europe. And the, uh, the dreads have been Adirondack tops. And there's a commonality in the trebles. They're very fat. Fat trebles. Just a nice, just a real nice lyrical, as what we would call it in the classical guitar world, lyrical sustain on these. But you're able to make them pop out when you want. Really, really nice. Nice, just round tone. out the bass. Now this is a mahogany instrument that has a lot of bass. That's bass. Thank you. 
big old fat C chord on this thing. Uh, of course, it's not exclusive to the C. You, uh, you will hear that all over in this instrument. I played a little bit earlier before we did the video. What's long? Wait a minute, I'm going to be flat. I thought it was quitting time already. I'm getting ahead of myself. So get her up here to the key of A. The old man, and she's right in there, ain't she? good balance you know we got all that bass and we've got that fat treble but uh, we've also got strong mids um, you know it, it, mahogany I can mess up anything but even if I build a mahogany guitar it, it should have some decent mids in it uh, it might not have nothing else <laughs> so but uh, sometimes if we get bass heavy uh, we can we can drown out our mids, and that is certainly not happening on this. So you got the full spectrum here. B flat. swell recording guitar all four of these uh, siren acoustic guitars have been swell recording guitars <laughs> Splendid, splendid, we'll take her down to the fifth fret. That's fret five if you're counting. <laughs> if you're kind of new to this, <laughs> these bars here go down to the fifth one.
inject a little bit of color here. So once again, we have a newer instrument that's uh, just starting to uh, wake up every morning and figure out that it's a guitar now. And you heard how it sounds. You hear how it sounds right now. And this is a new instrument. It's not a played-in instrument. It's not something that somebody's had and uh, uh, you know done done the whole gamut on for a few years to get it to sound this way. This is a brand new guitar. And uh, the sound speaks for itself. What else do you want me to tell you? Uh, one and three quarter nut is what we got on this one. This is a two and five sixteenths uh, spacing on the bridge. Uh, ebony, ebony. And uh, this is an Adirondack spruce top. They got some nice cream binding on here. Um, and then we got Honduran mahogany back and sides. Forward shifted scalloped X uh, and just a splendid, splendid sounding instrument, you know, very open sounding already. Uh, and this is a, a, a neck that is, uh, you know, we would call it 30s inspired, uh, larger neck. And uh, so, you know, it's kind of, I, I, I dig that. I dig that. Um, I like that, and this is uh, this has got a nice, healthy carve on up. But you know, you can bar chord it still. I mean, you can, you're still there. So uh, it's nice, uh, nice deal here. And uh, check out these uh, these are Grovers with amber buttons. I didn't know uh, that they made Grovers with amber buttons and it's true that they what they say that you learn something every day and I, that is one of the, just one of the many things I learned today um, this is a just a dandy dandy guitar and uh, if you're interested in siren acoustic guitars uh, this is for sale uh, they'll put it right in your home because you gotta pay for it first and uh, you know, if you're looking for something a little bit different, check out the small body videos that we've done on them and uh, check out the Padoo video and check them out on Facebook. Check out their website. Uh, they, they're not boxed in. They're not boxed into just a, uh, you know, Martin inspired creations or, or anything like that. They, they are very well aware of, of uh, various options. And they don't they don't turn up their nose at uh, different ideas. So check them out and, and uh, you know support support these guys. Uh, I really hope you will. And uh, please subscribe. But see that description box and y'all take care.